A relative calm is slowly returning to Suyan village in Baragoi, Samburu County. The villagers here picking up the pieces after a deadly raid by cattle rustlers that claimed the lives of two herders. Three others are recuperating at the Mararal Referral Hospital. Gusi imeenda, ngombe imeenda. Sasa tukabidi kushama hii unga alafu tuweka kwa mfuko alafu watoto wakule tu pole pole kwa sababu hatuna na mingine. Nilipata umasikini kwa dakika kwa madakika sio dakika hata seconds. Nilipata umasikini hapo sababu ngombe yangu yote ilienda hapo. Samburu Governor Moses Lenol Kulal accompanied by county leaders toward the area to condole with the affected families. And, uh, as leadership we want to urge our people to remain calm and uh, hoping that the government security agencies will take action against the known culprits. Mm, it's unfortunate that uh, quite a number of years down the line we are still dealing with cattle wrestling. Governor Lenol Kulal assured residents that his administration will work closely with the national government to enhance security in the region that is prone to banditry attacks. And we urge them and we hope the government that we serve, the government that serves the people of Kenya, to see that we are losing property and this is our livelihood. We are glad that the CS Interior, uh, Matiangi mentioned uh, the issues of cut wrestling and we hope we'll be able to see action, real action this time round because we have a few people, particularly in Samburu North, that have been engaged in this um, <coughs> archaic way of life. And, and it's quite disturbing that it's still happening at this age and time. The leaders and residents alike, however, raised concerns over what they termed as laxity by security agents, saying no culprits have been apprehended more than 24 hours since the attack. Our security ambayo wali nipati hapa suyan, awesu kusaidia. Sa hii ni mara ya tatu ambayo mifuko ilianda hapa na awesu kusaidia awesu kwa kambi.